Alright, so I got a request from Q Smashers to make a video on uh, what a developed product is and how to make it. So, when he initially asked me this question, I wasn't exactly entirely sure what a developed product was. Now, I'm sure you guys have seen it, it's in quite a few games, so I'm going to go ahead and give you a pretty broad definition on what it is before I get started with explaining how to develop it. Now, if you see a game pass compared to a developer product, they may look similar, but the difference between is a game pass can be purchased once, and you can use it to obtain certain items depending on what they give, or just a donation, some of that. But a developer product can be bought multiple times with currency, say as in ticks or robux. So say, it's good for in-game currency, or an example would be minigame madness. There's perks you can buy each round, which would be plus a certain amount of speed. That was created using developer product. If you were to check the developer product on the wiki, you'll get this definition. Developer products are assets with, which have the capability of being bought more than once. Emphasis on more than once. With this ability, developers are, developer products are perfect for in-game currencies or ammo purchases. It should be noted that the developer products, unlike game passes, which are place specific, can be sold in any game within a universe, provided that the develop, developer product was created on the universe's configuration page. So it's saying, basically, game passes which are per place, if you try making a universe, in your lobby you create a pass that's, you say, um, obtain plus 20 HP. You could only use that within that, um, it's called, within that place. Now say you were to buy a developer product within the lobby called plus 20 HP, you can still use that same plus 20 HP concept throughout your entire universe. Now one thing, unlike um, Game Passes, Roblox doesn't actually record the purchase of the developer product. Basically it's not going to say that you bought it and you have proof of buying it, like it does with a Game Pass. When you buy a Game Pass, it'll say, yeah, you own this Game Pass and you have it. With a developer product, you can basically push it if... Your, the developer is responsible for making sure it's saved. It's, it's typically done with data stores if you're using a universe. The issue with this is if someone doesn't do it right, you could end up having a scam going on where people, where you're buying a developer product and it's not saving and you're losing your money, basically. Then it comes down to the actual question at hand. How do you make a developer product? Well, first, you're going to want to go to the game or universe that you're making the developer product. Developer product for. Then you're going to want to um, make sure you go to your configures. Once you get this, you have the option for under configuring the place you have developer products. You can, you can create a developer product. You can give it a name, say, um, let's call it Learn to or no. I'll just do the plus 20 HP thing, plus 20 HP. Increased max HP by 20. Price in Robux, say we made it one Robux in five ticks. You can choose an image. Whatever. I'm just going to go ahead and use one of the sample pictures from my computer. Just so I don't really like doing it. I koala. We got to go with a koala. Once you have your image selected, it upload. you can upload it and create it. The thing is, once you actually make your product, the cool thing is, it's not like a game pass. Once you make it, you can't really do anything else to it. You can choose to edit it. You can rename it. You can change the picture. You can pretty much ever edit everything about it. So you don't have to sit here and keep remaking new ones and deleting old ones. So that pretty much sums up the question on how to create a developer product. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel for more if you haven't already. Leave a comment below and give it a thumbs up if you guys want to see more my, more videos from me. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.